Okay. A jet flies 102.5 miles in 25 minutes. At that rate, how far will it go in 2.5 hours? Go ahead. First thing first. Greenet's direct proportion problem. Y equals k times x. You're going to figure out um, y is the number of miles, right? k is your unit rate. Um, x is going to be um, the number of hours, okay? So that's time, this is distance, and this is your unit rate. So we're given 102.5 miles in 25 minutes. Go ahead, plug that in. 102.5 miles equals k times 25 minutes. Oh, but they want it in 2.5 hours. So let's go ahead and convert these minutes into hours. 102.5 miles equals k times 25 minutes is how much of an hour? Let's go ahead and reduce. See how much of an hour this is? Divide by 5, divide by 5, 5. Is five sixths of an hour. So go ahead and divide by five sixths on both sides. One o two point five divided by five six equals k, your unit rate. So one hundred two point five over one. That's the same thing as one hundred two point five because it's just divided by itself. Division turns into multiplication. Five six turns into reciprocal. It's six fifths now equals k. So I see I see um common factors of five. Five divided by five is one. One hundred and two point five divided by five is five into one zero, five into ten twice. Five times two ten zero bring down the two zero five bring down the five. Five and twenty five is five, so 5 times 5 is 25, minus 0, so bring back the decimal. So then 20.5 20 point, 20 at the top right here. So 20.5 times 6 over 1 times 1 equals the unit rate. Now what is 20.5 times 6? Let's go ahead and find out. 5 times 6 is 30. 0 here, 3 on top. 0 times 6 is 0, plus 3 is 3. 2 times 6 is 12. Go ahead and use the same number of uh, decimal places your multiple can. That's going to be 123. So 123 over 1 times 1 is 1. It's K is K is 123 um, miles in a minute. Miles per minute, right? That's your unit rate. But it asks how. At that rate, how far will it go in 2.5 hours? So go ahead, plug it back into the formula. Y equals k times x. I'm going to plug in 123 miles per minute for k. And we need to figure out um, how far. That's the distance, and they give you time of 2.5 hours. So times 2.5 hours. And we don't know what the distance is, but that be y. So y equals 123 times 2.5. So go ahead, figure it out, out on the side. 123 times 2.5. 3 times 5 is 15. 5 over here, 1 up here. 2 times 5 is 10. 10 plus 1 is 11. 1 here, 1 here. 1 times 5 is 5. 5 plus 1 is 6. Place by the whole 0. And go ahead and delete the 1 and 1. 3 times 2 is 6. Four ti uh, 2 times 2 is 4. 1 times 2 is 2. Add. 5 plus 0 is 5, 1 plus 6 is 7, 6 plus 4 is 10, 0 here, 1 up here, 1 plus 2 is 3. How many decimal places in your um, multiple can? 1 here, so 1 over here. So then y equals 307.5 miles. Because remember, y equals distance, so it has to be a mile. 307.5. 